Oh, baby. You know what? I was really like, uh, okay, I'm gonna take a break now. Oh. And, you know, you're not gonna have a chance to vote about if I color the car with flowers or not. And you probably didn't get to the end of the video, most of you, so... Uh, I figured I'll say at the beginning of this video, if you want this bad boy... ...to get turned into... F ...floral? Let me know in the comments. Uh, or keep it, uh... Keep it sharky. And whatever gets voted the most, or... ...commented the most. That's the one we're doing, baby. And yeah, I'm playing that comment game. I'm playing that game where people have to comment and get my shit up in the algo. Alright, we're rolling deep. Let's go, baby. Kick the car for good luck. Hit it. Hitting fucking everything but the engine to start the car. And I parked it. Alright. I haven't got one new one of these bad boys lately. Just got one bobblehead. And I think I just rolled over my damn foot with a computer chair. God damn it. Alright. Uh, I really don't know what this upgrade was that's supposed to like launch me deep into... But do I play that dirty game where I go here, but I have to commute all the way back, or do we focus on the story? I'm feeling, I'll be honest, I'm feeling a little story driven right now. I'm feeling a little story driven. That's where my, that's where my heart's at. So I'm, I'm sticking with that. I'm not in exploring mode, I'm in a curiosity mode. I want to know what's happening next. But we do... As per usual, need to pick up those guys to see if works that might get God damn, I hate these tires. <laughs> I hate these tires so much. I should have just switched to the off road ones. I took off my limb bumper too. I forgot about that. I want to put my steel bumper on. So I can just freaking ram into shit. I don't even know. I don't even understand what the limb bumper did completely, to be honest with you. I know it definitely. Oh my god, it definitely helps with radiation. And I was just laying in radiation before. Chimichangas. Everybody likes a good chimichanga. Oh no. I don't even know what a chimichanga is. I forgot. Oh my god. Traveling the world together. So as my monitor is really low down. It's better. I'm cranking my neck. That didn't sound right. You know what I mean? Dude, look how pretty this looks. Gasolina. What's up, Gary? He's a good guy, Gary. He doesn't mean any harm. Our efficiency is going to be through the roof. Look at oh my 
god. Sign me up. Put me on a team. I work for like UPS or something. I'm like... Logistics. Logistics guy. Definitely also another person who knows what left and the right right now. Oh my god. Awesome. you tell that we're going downhill right now? I feel like we're going flat. But we're clearly dropping down a cliff. That's tree number Yeah, actually, I want to do that on purpose. Did that on purpose too. Watch this. You ready? Did it on purpose. Whereas I used to say in high school, I did that on perp. I try to make that, you know, thing, and it never did become a thing. In case you're wondering. So sorry. All right, let's 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 get down this hill and fix the car. Um, let's just show it some respect. I'm sorry, buddy. And then we'll take the road there. It seems like it'll be faster anyway. All right, what do we need to fix? The whole front of the car. Planning on needing a ceiling kit already, but okay, the road's right in front of me. We gotta take the left. Charge me up, Buttercup. I ain't afraid of you. I remember being a kid and you go to the lake and the thunderstorm would come and your family had to get to uh, the car. And I always thought it was so interesting, like being in the car and the, the thunder is like cracking away. And you just felt so uh, safe inside the car. I don't know why. That's like such a... There you go. I'm safe <laughs> from the thunderstorms. Perfect. Perfect example right there. I always just like that. Lost 
tell my girlfriend the other day that uh, stupid stuff I used to do as a kid. Uh, one of them was we used to have a station wagon, and we would go on vacation up in the uh, Catskill Mountains. All right, speaking of mountains, let's get off this thing. And when I would sit in the back, oh my god, dude! Like. Fuck it. Oh my god. I would sit in the back of the car and uh like where is this road? Like why is this so uh difficult for me? Premium Witness me! I was in the back in the station wagon where you would, uh, they would put the seats up in the trunk and you could, um, and you could see the people in the back, you know, on the highway. And as a kid, you weren't so embarrassed, so you would just stare at those people, you didn't care. Uh, but me and my, who was my cousin or my friend? We would see how many Cheerios we could swallow whole before choking. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, I survived that. Um, and my friend did. So, now, uh, I'm the winner. That's called, uh, shoot, it's called evolution. Natural selection at its finest. And I guess in Sweden, nobody really knew what Cheerios were, so my girlfriend thought uh, I said Oreos. So she legitimately thought I swallowed three Oreos at the same time. That, I don't think, is humanly possible. You'd have to... I don't know. Cover them and lube them up in Vaseline. Now this is content. All right, let's see what we got here. Oh, we got a new, we got a new message. Let's check that out. And also, it's a good time to. Oh, okay. We got a. This is a. Oh, baby, we're going to loot up, finally. I love it. Feel, I'm actually feeling a little looty now. Before, I wasn't. Now that I'm seeing all this stuff I need, I'm feeling looty. Car? There it is. Okay. Uh, oh, wrong button. Wait, that looks like it's not looted. I love me some tree candy. Does anybody know, like, I hate these purple and red things. Just get me out of here. Is this what's going on over here? Because this is going to upset me. Does anybody know, like, this thing down here, does anybody know? Was this in the game since the beginning? Or, like, that just showed up one day, right? Alright, we got some uh, audio. After the multi-stage evacuation of the Olympic Peninsula's 100,000 strong population, the records get sketchy. Once the region is swept clean of civilian eyes, the flow of information trickles to an eventual stop. Arda has always maintained that the evacuation was done in the name of national security. That there was simply nothing more patriotic than sacrificing your homes, with the communists plotting our demise across the Atlantic. 
Certainly not because there was any danger from the strange experiments happening inside, or situations most unnatural to witness. Arna kept the wide berth, displacing citizens far ahead of the front line, so first-hand accounts of things going awry were rare. But rumors spread fast, and everyone had some story about a distant relative whose pet changed in inexplicable ways, or a friend of a friend who followed strange lights into the woods and never returned. Once the civilians cleared out, the Arda employees moved in. Scientists, officials, support staff, and their families made the Olympic Exclusion Zone home, reaching anywhere from 300 to 1,000 in total at its peak. What any of them were doing in the zone was kept hush-hush, with the population just outside the walls found secrecy irresistible. Every shipment of raw material, out-of-season weather pattern, an inexplicable light or sound became the talk of the town for the first decade of the zone's existence. Bad job getting a charge on the battery, though, that's for sure. We're low on gas. Well, um, yeah, we're going deep in. into another storm. Damn it. Hmm. Should I... It's yellow. I, I shouldn't really heal the main parts of the car until they're red. It's like a waste of putty. Putty. We will grab this. Do need some battery, though. So I'm confused. My battery is like that. But is this also... And how about you? Yeah, okay. So it's just the main battery that's... What the fuck? It's a bomb. It's a bomb box. It's a blacksmith. Oh no! Come on, man! What's your deal, dude? Location. This this place just gave me a flat freaking tire. God damn it! to how we used to have batteries back in the day. I think we usually started with like 30. Oh, wow, look at my health. I had no idea. Get in the 
car, dude. Get in the car. Close the door. Close that door. Whew. That was close. Damn, that was another bomb box right there. So there are quite a few bomb boxes over here. Super engine to, to make this turn. I don't appreciate that. something on top of that hill there. Let's get out of the car. Let's heal up. Uh, shit, I got a flat in the back too. How many more of those? Uh, I don't have any more of those. Damn. Front right panel. Buddy. This ain't Pacific Drive anymore, this is Pacific Jog. Buses, little tourist traps over here. I'm, I'm in Karski. What do you think, Karski? Where are we going next? We grabbing this? Oh, man, that was a pain in the ass. The flat tires has actually become a real problem. Which makes me kind of want to build uh, those tires, that the puncture-proof tires. Right, let's stay on the road here. Source. Oh, an Olympian pain, dude. Am I collecting it? Like, is it coming out or? This is freaking awesome! Is there another Olympian vein here? No, I guess that was freaking awesome that we found one of those. I don't see another one nearby. That hopefully that's the Olymp <gasps> My guy. It's Olympian fragment. 
Lionel pet, pet Daryl for me. And it was a form of celebration. Steve Jobs, leave another awkward comment. Some of your comments I don't know what the hell you're talking about, but I love them. What's the other guy? Don O'Daly. Got one. Yeah, our headlights are gonna turn off. So. We got no rain. We got no wind. Uh, we got no electricity. And we got no signal. <laughs> Damn it. Uh, what do I do now? What is this? Uh, damp forest, residential, residential area. Toggle legend. Travel. What does this mean? No signal. I'm gonna look it up. Pacific Drive. No signal. And then on Steam it says, Root map, no signal. Just went through a junction to go to a new area. And the map just says, no signal. I can't leave the menu. Face the same problem. Same. That's a further one. And you can go. It's a question mark on the road number sign thingy for locations. That means it's unavailable location yet. But the area is unstable and need to go somewhere else on the map. Pretty sure this is a bug that's fixed just by closing and restarting the game to force the game to reload at the checkpoint you just hit. And not experienced it myself, but seen others run into it. If you run through the gate after the effects of an anomaly passes you, passes, you can go through no issue and the map will load and you can select the non-stop. The next stop. Huh. So I can't even pause the game. All right. Well. Uh, let's give it a. We're giving you guys a behind-the-scenes look of. Uh, Just another gaming channel. Uh, nope. All right. Now you know. I know what my desktop looks like. And now you know I only play Phasmophobia. I haven't played that in a while, actually. Fuck. The anomaly barricade. I think this is fair to say. There was no continue button here. And this is the longest hours. The longest hours. The longest time played. No, because I don't have the Olympian whatever 
dude. What the hell, skis? Heal me up, baby. like some add-on where the car just automatically opens that door for me to be honest. I see some oh whoa 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 not good. Not good. A little too close or comfortable. What is that purple? Oh, is that another vein? Those jellyfish bastards better stay away from me. I hear them. They're coming for me. This is great. This is actually better than before. We're gonna get what we need anyway. Let's go. Oh no. What the hell was that? getting more than before. This actually worked out, ladies and gentlemen. We got more than we did before. Wait, let me just... Let me just, uh... Put this up. We'll grab some HP from here. Where we at? What health are we at? 67, that's fine. Okay. Uh, let's just... I was about to say, let's just get out of here, but you know me. Also, the good news is, I don't have flat tires anymore. So, the only thing that could be worse... This actually worked out for us. I'm actually happy. I am I have a net positive out of that reset. So, thank you, Ironwood. Oh my goodness. Oh, I'm missing my jumps. Get back. Damn. It's like I'm heading right towards the thing. It's like, I, how do I not pick it up if I'm going to go right at it? And we can fill up the tank here. No, you nerd ropes. Let go. like that. You guys like that? A little realistic parking? I'll tell you right now. Much easier to drive in real life. I have done enough research to say that's a fact. I 
had to cattle prod our battery. No, not SpongeBob SquarePants. Oh. Guys, nice, stop! Please. I can't see shit behind me either. I know you like that. Is there a road around here? Also, I have the limb shield. Oh, and I'm wondering if I should put the limb shield or just. I like the other shield that actually... Oh, it's a blacksmith. Damn it. Let's get out of here. Do not freeze again. Yes! Alright. This, is, this worked out so good. We got, instead of getting like seven of those Olympian pieces, we got 27. Which means we're inching our way to that badass engine. I need to turn the light on for a second. It's getting dark in here. Oh, jeez. All right, what we got here? Main mission. Let's check it out. What's the main mission now? Reach the barricade operating station. Give us Do the rundown, like Francis. What, we should fix Me? the car at all? The electrical grid is your department. Uh, you know the plan as well as I do. Oh, the battery's dead. So you'd rather trust me than have to speak up for yourself? Uh, uh. I guess you're on your own, driver. Good luck. Okay, fine. The regular anchors aren't enough to overcharge the arc device to the level we need. But, there's an old anomaly barricade we can piggyback onto. It's archaic technology, an early attempt to stop anomalies from drifting out into the wider Olympic Peninsula. It worked for some time. Until it didn't. But, long enough to get the old wall built. The barricade's in bad shape, but what's a little rampant voltage leakage? It's also rampant. Not like the ghosts and goblins of the deep zone will mind. And if they do, more the better for Francis. Huh? Appreciate the olive branch, Oppy, but boy, do you have a lot to learn about the paranormal. I'd be happy to give you a primer after all this is over. Ugh, hard pass. I'm far too old for that. The car will induce a current along the barricade, in the same way you did it crossing the old wall. Every connection point needs to be induced within a limited time. Electrify the entire barricade, uh, and we'll have now, all the power just we need. At home. You heard him. Floor it, driver. Okay. You heard him. Floor it, drive up. Wait, the battery's fully charged. Did I? Does that end up charging the whole battery when I.
That's not good. Don't like that. Come on, baby. Okay. Perfect. We got a little valley here we can ride down. You're near the barricade's operating station. Can you get in there and look around? We need something that'll give us the lay of the land. I got a feeling I might have to set this to the ship. Link all the barricade gates optional. Scan barricade map in the operations tower. That. Aw, this guy's giving free hugs. Uh oh. No, oh, so close. What are you talking about? So close for what? I didn't even attempt anything. Oh, scan the map. Perfect. I'm uploading the barricade map to your arc device. By my calculations, if you electrify all eight posts, you'll have all the power you need. Okay, so I guess Bobby, we... does that seem right? Does it seem right to you? I, I, I think so. Yeah, I, I ran the numbers a few times and I... Then get to it, driver. Oh, wow. So, I guess we do a lap around the town? These things aren't going. Am I supposed to press a button to start that, or... This thing, I gotta go like this, at a certain speed. favorite one when it reverses, which reverses my steering. Got this. 
Come on. No, no, no. Come on. Gigajoules and holding steady. Good. Then we're all set. The arc device is ready to go. It'll hold that charge for as long as we need it. Cool. Let's fix this bad boy up then. Pedal to the metal driver. Storm's coming. Well, I'm, I'm gonna do it. I'm just... Can I fix this, please? Are we going here or are we going here? Reach the gateway. Let's just go to the gateway, like it says. the car's arc device and escape back. Dude, let's go. Let's freaking go, dude. What did we pull out of that? Four corrupt, two stable. But I think the big thing nice is that we pulled a bunch there. of it. The whale could be a lot. Take your time and gear up. No telling what that remnant's going to unleash. Okay. Um, nice. Uh, let's put that in there. We'll do that. 
was you, what do you want? Hey driver, I sent you something if you don't mind taking a look. Um, Olympia, June 20, uh, 27, 1969, describing his actions as downright peculiar. Olympia police have detained the man for further questioning, but say they have not yet pressed charges. Meanwhile, protests continue downtown as federal workers and their families express their displeasure at ongoing ARDA layoffs. Tobias his favorite cryptid of them all. If it's oh. not too much to ask, uh, if you could put it on your dashboard so Tobias can come along for the ride for wherever you're going. Uh, but don't feel obligated by any means. Dude, are you kidding me? Of course we put a Tobias uh, statue on. Dude. Poor Tobias. He sacrificed himself. Meanwhile, we got people, you know, sacrificing themselves, and you're giving me three copper, Dusty. Think about that while you're out here alone. Anyway. Where, where, where was I? Let's take this one. Did I do this backwards? Yep. Yes, I did. Okay. That's all we need there. Super pump. Um, yeah, we gotta heal up, but what can we do? What is it? Where's this engine? So we can build some. Li so we need four limb chips. One, two, three, four. We need ten explosives, and we need. Olympium fragment. Okay. Dude, we got this. Oh, man. I had a little, like, questioning hope on that one for a little bit. And guess what, buddy? You're coming with me. You're getting recycled. Ah, damn it. There we go. I think it was in here, right? Here we got a lightning rod. Good. Yeah, we can't build any torches. All right, let's just go around like the old school, old school way of doing things. Bada bing, bada boom. I just I want to double check. I didn't have any more of those in here for some reason. Yeah, I did. That's not, no, I did, but I had a similar thing in there. Okay, so. And we're fixing, we're changing the tires out, for sure. Um, I'll heal this. But I'm definitely bringing the steel bumper back. And then if we need, for some reason, the, uh... For some reason, we need the the limb. What's it called? The limb shield. I can leave it in the trunk of the car. Fairly certain I needed the limb shield for that last mission, but I don't know for sure. I think we're 
good there. the steel impact bumper impact that's the no armored oops oops come on you've been playing this game for what 60 hours let's go there we go nope that's not what i meant to do let's take this i think there should be room in here there you go and then we'll put this bad boy on now we can really ram into shit uh, okay. That's that. We got a lot of stuff in there. Let's clean up. And let's see what we can buy. Oh no, we gotta, uh... We got to check the quirks on this guy. We got two more quirks again. Damn it. Yeah, we don't have a ton of... Uh, 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 the car switches on... Winter Wipers toggle. Oh my god. Okay, 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 okay. So something switches on and the windshield wipers do something. So I should have another clue here. The radio switches on, the windshield wipers, what do they do? The radio switches on, what do the windshield wipers do? Windshield wipers turn on. The uh, no, when the radio turns on, the windshield wipers speed up. When the radio turns on, the windshield wipers uh, move fast. Yes, dude, I'm I'm a damn mechanic, baby. I'm a freaking mechanic. Here, me a mechanics kit. Fix work. Yes. Okay. So now we got another thing here with the car. Um, when the car. Mm, receives an anchor. I'm just guessing here. The horn. The horn didn't... No, none of that stuff happened. Hmm. Where do we want to spend the... Maybe it's better if I spend it here, because then I can actually test something. When the car moves backwards... The headlights... Switch off. Mm. Uh, no, none of this stuff was happening. The steering wheel inverts direction? I don't think that was happening. Maybe the wipers, something happened with the wipers again? 
Okay, something did happen to the wipers again. So let's figure that out. When the car moves backwards, the wipers do what? When the car moves backwards, what do the wipers do? They don't turn on. They slow down. Okay. Oh, that bothers me. Doesn't that bother you guys? Okay. And the car moves backwards. The wipers. Oops. Slow down. Move slow. Correct diagnosis. Latrician's kit. I definitely have one of those. Boom, baby. Cool. That's fixed. Let's see. What type of stuff do we have in here to fix the car? Uh, we have... We're going to need... Just health. Yeah, we need... We're going we're gonna to need resources soon. I feel it. Uh, we're going to need one of these just in case. Can't kit. Another one of these. Nutrition's kit. All right, let's put all these in. Okay. Next thing was. What can we buy here? We need limb magnets for that. A repair station. What is this? Give yourself a little help patching up your car every time you return to the garage, the garage with a powerful automatic regenerator. Marsh eggs, limb magnets. Dude. What? I'm writing that, I'm noting that. I have a notepad here. We want a repair station. We want a repair station, and we we're going after that uh, repair station, and we're going after that engine. And for the repair station, we need marsh eggs, and we need some limb magnets. Limb magnets, 15, 12 more, and uh, Jesus, yep, a lot of marsh eggs, okay, 588. No, sorry, 500. Yeah, 88. More shanks. No. Yeah. 78. 578 more shanks. Uh, okay. Uh, damn. No, we, we don't want to use any of that stuff. Uh, but that's it. Cool. All right, I think we're doing good. We're in a good place. Let's just see if we can upgrade the outfits at all. That's what I'm wearing. Uh, that's what we're wearing. Okay, nothing to, nothing to upgrade here. Cool. All right, guys. Take care of yourselves. And I'll catch you in the next one. Take care. Peace.